What's happening? It's your boy Jay Anonymous. You feel me? And welcome to another episode of Anonymous Crypto. Now, you already know I've been really going hard with these NFTs, right? I've been really going hard with these NFTs. But Atari, y'all remember Atari, man. If you were born in the 70s, 80s, 90s, or if you play video games, period, you know Atari, okay? Atari founder is launching augmented reality NFTs on Ethereum, okay? Now, first thing we're going to do is, what is augmented reality, right? What is augmented reality, okay? Now, augmented reality is an interactive, of course, this is Wikipedia. I, I, I get that before you say anything, whatever. Augmented reality is an interactive experience of a real world environment where the objects that reside in the real world are enhanced by computer generated perceptual information, sometimes across multiple sensory mod modalities, including visual auditory haptic. I don't, I, I don't know. I can't remember what haptic is or somatosensory. Don't know what that is either. Or olfactory. Um, I'm assuming that's oral. I don't know. Okay. But anyway, just want to let you know what that is. So back to this. We have the article, okay, by Atari. Boom, you remember this old school Pong, all of that? They started that. Nolan Bushnell, founder of Atari, will release NFTs based on classic arcade mechanics via Maker's Place. All of the NFTs let owners view the arcade machine in 3D via augmented reality technology, right? As the founder of legendary video game company Atari, Nolan Bushnell helped bring arcade gaming to the masses. And now with the advent of NFTs, he plans to bring some of those formative early machines into homes as digital augmented reality collectibles. Today, Bushnell and NFT marketplace Makers Place announced the Arcade OG series, a set of Ethereum based collectibles. And NFT is a token. We don't need to get into what NFT is, but... That's going to be what's going on. So let's move past each arcade OG series collectible is more than just a simple video clip. However, it also comes with an augmented reality experience that lets you view the 3D rendering of the arcade cabinet within any real world space. Owners will be able to drop the digital cabinet into place and then walk around it, viewing it up close from all angles. Augmented reality experiences typically use your smartphone or tablet's cameras and sensors to display your real world surroundings with digital elements on top. Some mobile apps use the technology for interactive games and shopping experiences. NFT marketplace Vive, which works with brands like Marvel and Star Trek, also offer 3D digital statuses or statues that you can view on a screen set against your real world backdrop. So. So basically kind of works like how green screen works in a way, if you if you kind of just but instead of your eyes, instead of the green screen playing tricks on your eyes, your camera and your phone is doing that. OK, same thing. So, with that being said, Atari got some things cracking. They smacking. Don't be lacking and get to packing so that you can get you something, okay? You might want to go ahead and get over here and get it get get it going because I'm going to keep making these videos. We're going to keep moving up, going up. <clears throat> Information going to keep getting put out there. That's what it is. So, with that being said, my name is Jay Anonymous. This is the Anonymous Crypto Channel. We are...